Basically, basically before uh, complication arises, uh, I want to say how I do basically is step is to prevent complication. So I do reverse or modify reverse and do everything before everything. Do first everything means piston placement and second everything means total removal of the anticura or superstructure. Now just just three minutes already video. Now. This is the reverse. Now, last two years, I am uh, doing every step is with the CO2 laser, luminous laser. So, it's very comfortable. And here, the full reverse, sometimes not possible, half reverse, modified reverse. They are modified in modified reverse, here, posterior crudotomy and cerebral tendon vaporize first, then, uh, then fenestration, then piston placement, and last anticrotomy. That is the most important. Because the why last anticrotomy, that is the main problem. Because that during, if uh, posterior crotomy after that piston placement, antecro will be there, then stepis movement will be less. So for junior also, piston placement is very, very simple. Basically, all are stable structure. Otherwise, sometimes I have seen also, lots of movement, no, sometimes as uh, there. So complexion started there. So preserve the antecro at last. And then crimp and last antecrotomy. So I will show first antecrotomy, how uh, do surgery and how antiquity remove and why, how the problem faced how, and how managed. This is the simplest, 99% antiquity will be the simplest. Sometimes I have shown the some antiquity are, uh, are all fixed. Here the simplest way, just uh, doing antiquity. But sometimes antiquity focus, otoscopy focus too much hard antiquity. Then is the problem. So I will show this. This is the difficult. Look here. When I, I uh, try to um. move, then I think that full foot plate is moving. Excuse me. So sir. if I Triangle. remove it, Triangle. so here, when I try to remove the antecura, then whole foot plate is moving. So how will manage it? Look here. Just movement. So if I remove, try to remove, then foot plate will be totally moved. And there is a chance of SN loss. To avoid it, how it will be managed? Look here, I stopped here. And just look, movement. Now I place the laser and just vaporize that portion. Okay. And simply remove it. So here, no chance of foot plate movement also and consequence of SN loss also. So sometimes at during antiquity also you will face problem. So how will be prevented? That is also here. So simply I removed it. Yeah. So just simply removed. So and another advantage, in case sleep, chance is less because some uh, part of the posterior cruda and anterior will be there. So sometimes uh, piston uh, revision in case of revision step is, I have seen a lot of uh, piston displacement. So that is also advantage with this technique. Okay. Thank yeah. you so much. Thank you. Please join the panel. Hey, with skitter, but skitter, skitter, the moment is there. Right. And right. if you leave, I think the result will be the same. Right. So, so leaving, leaving it would give the same results. If you can remove it, well and good. If you cannot, leave it. Thank you. So I think uh, Dr. Amit Kesri is not There's here. one point. Problem with all, almost all of us that if there is a bleeding, I mean, what should be the take home message? Don't, don't panic. Don't panic. So, and how you managed it? No, we, the, you can put uh, little, small little strips of gel form there, very thin strips. Right. Size of a piston, leave it there. It will absorb the blood. And then you leave it there. The gel has got a structure that will allow fibroblasts to form there. Right. So you leave it there for about one or two minutes and most of the bleeding will stop. You, okay. can probably, you probably do it maybe once or twice. One uh, question just yeah, to without, add on to… Just, just uh, only gel form, no yeah. adrenal. Yeah, one question to add on. Supposingly you have done a fenestra. Yeah, even then. Even then, you can, yeah, we can you very can, well can use gel form there. Yeah, you can use gel If it is bleeding a lot because… Blood actually is not good for the ear, in a ear. Right, perfect. So you allow blood to get inside, uh, it's not ideal. Uh, so best is to clear the out area. And when you are putting in the, uh, your piston, it's blessed that the, the, the fenestra area is clean without yeah. any blood. Yeah. Thank you. And don't use too much suction. 
no well, suction yeah, at no all. Suction no suction at, at, all at all in that area. Right, right, perfect. No suction at all. We, yeah. we just don't use Yeah, suction. doctor, please. Uh, for juniors, to prevent bleeding, this is the most important step is surgery. Uh, local anesthesia is the most important. I have seen my experience. If GA bleeding is more, and uh, adrenal concentration, uh, I prefer not in one in uh, one lakh, one in twenty thousand. One in twenty. You are simply using the ampule. Uh, basically, one in uh, twenty thousand. Yeah, two lakhs, hmm. and half uh, ample adrenaline mixed with the, that uh, bottle. Okay. That is the around one in uh, twenty lakhs. Tw one in twenty thousand. Uh, yeah, twenty thousand, and uh, bloodless fill will be achieved. Uh, has anyone of you encountered raised palpitations after infiltration one in twenty thousand? Yeah, uh, just few minutes, wait few minutes, and then it will be settled. Because up. I have uh, faced it. Uh, no, no, definitely. All temporomastia also faced sometimes yeah. huge uh, palpitation and problem is there for juniors also. Yeah. When no injection. Because it, it seems easy to do this, but I have abandoned one time when surgery because patient started having palpitations and patient was patient. It was a local anesthesia and patient became uneasy. Yeah, when you said palpitations, I thought the surgeon had palpitations. No, 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 no. I mean, as a patient yeah, had palpitations. The, the concept of GA yeah. producing more bleeding is wrong. Yeah, right. So the modern GA anesthesia right. with hypertension. They give us very good hypertension yeah. anesthesia. Yeah. Yeah. I do a large number of my patients uh, under general anesthesia. Oh, I think Omvisa is also completely doing uh, completely, under general anesthesia. Fair number. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, thank you.